Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever the fluff you are. I'm looking to what is going to be another one of those short, quick catch-ups of what's going on in this little area here. There's not much that's happened apart from we've got another pile of uh, stuff over there. I presume some of the diggings that have been going on is one when the archaeologists have done some of their um, lookings around. They're probably somewhere under there as well, like in all of the like underpass parking area under there as well. There's probably more excavations down there, even though the irony of that is I don't know whether you're actually going to see it because it probably won't view in, but it still says danger, deep excavations. No shot! <laughs> but yeah. This is going to be a short one because I don't really see much going on and I have to be somewhere else. But scaff is going on over there so it looks like there's more re-roofing going on over there as per usual. Um, this hasn't really changed much. There is a few cars parked over there. And there's, every now and then there's been a few people wandering around but not a lot has actually happened. I haven't had any updates. So before anyone asks, I don't know the timeline on this. I'm just going as I see it. So, yep. There's going to be a few more different things. There's definitely going to be, you know, uh, a rugby vlog or two going up in the next, um, like, two to three weeks. There might be a few more shorts coming up as well, because I've been trying that. Uh, Morning Morris! I've been having a go at doing Morning Morris for a little while. Don't know what's going on with this, either when they're actually going to start. Uh, working on any of this or anything like that because well timeline is timeline whenever it happens is whenever it happens as far as I know so that's um, by the by it has been open to the elements and some of that is internal concrete not external concrete so whether they're gonna do any patch ups and clean ups especially because there is a bit there which is getting a little bit frayed and a little bit thingy so there will be water ingress by the looks of that into the rebar. So that'll be interesting because they might have to pull some of that away. So that's going to be more stuff for them to do on the internal work. You can also see a couple of bits where there was some steels stuck together over there. So there's going to be a lot more stuff. Um, don't know whether there's going to be any underpass stuff over here either. There is a little bit of a mini excavation over here but again can't really get to it. All of the bin area is now actually boarded off, so no one can actually walk up there and get a different side view over there. There is bits and pieces over here and there. Um, I will put the eye on pause for a minute and see if I see anything else. If I don't, then that will be it. But I presume I'll find another angle to view you from. So for the moment, pause. Next little bit, I'm actually going to give sort of you a bit of a preview of something that I might do later on in time. I'm going to let Morris take over on this one. Go look at the mess that they made of this. Was it really necessary to tear it all down just to leave it as one disgusting slab? Who knows? People and their bright ideas. Nobody knows what they're doing anymore. They don't even bloody think. They just go in, go kasmash, kasmash, and then leave it all an empty mess what a waste what a waste hopefully they don't leave it like this for too bloody long it's a bit disgusting really but hey this is what you get this is what you get when people with no brains take over the reins anyway i think i'm gonna do your head in if i keep talking like this and keep moaning on I think some of you know what you are, know what some of you are thinking, and you know what I'm thinking. This is a blooming shame and it's a mess. But hey, some people might think it's a good idea, I don't. Really, I think they should have thought about it a little bit more, and whoever keeps saying that that needs to be turned into an arena, yeah, I'm with you, mate, I'm with you. But it's a flipping shame because they've left some of this all alone and to be honest who on earth is going to want to live in an apartment block right here right when you've got a bloody great big road there and all that noise that comes from that people that don't live here that's who 
we just come here, take a take a flipping apartment up, and then they'll go to Liverpool or go work in Manchester or something. I think that's the idea, isn't it? So you can get all of those professional monies in, isn't it? You know what? It's not gonna work. And to be honest, who on earth is gonna want to stay in a so-called luxury hotel in the middle of a town centre that has nothing in it? Anyway, Moni Murray's out. I'll let the other person back out again. But yeah, see? there you go. Anyway, that has been that. So, just give you a quick spin round. Back onto me. Anyway, Morris says it all for you. So, I will peace out. See you again in a few days. Maybe, maybe, but uh, don't give yourself a brain aneurysm, don't think too hard on life. You only get one shot at life, so make it your best. Don't stress too much, save your mental health. If you need to talk, talk to someone. Everyone's always there. Peace out, see you, Sarside. Goodbye.